Welcome to IBM Support TV, where we answer questions and share technical support information, hints and tips on IBM products. How do I configure a dynamic outbound endpoint SSL configuration to use SSL underscore TLS V2? Note, before performing any steps, please back up your configuration. Backupconfig.sh or that back can be used from the WebSphere bin directory depending on your operating system. Log in with your credentials. Expand security. Click SSL certificate and key management. Click SSL configurations. Click new. Type a name of your choosing. For trust door name, choose cell default trust door. Choose the key store name you want. Important, if you change it from the default, click Get Certificate Aliases. Click My New SSL Configuration. Click Quality of Protection QOP Settings. Select SSL underscore TLS v2 as the protocol. This will allow TLS v1.0, TLS v1.1, and TLS v1.2 to be used. You can select any specific protocol at this time if your needs are different. If you need to customize the ciphers, you can do so below. Click OK. Click Save. Click SSL Certificate and Key Management. Click Dynamic Outbound Endpoint SSL Configurations. Click New. Type a name for your outbound connection. You can set the scope of your outbound connection here. Type a description. Type your connection information. Specifies select information in the form target protocol, target host, and target port for the outbound connection. An asterisk can be used to mean all protocols, hosts, or ports. An example of selection criteria is star comma www.ibm.com comma star, which means that anytime the target host is www.ibm.com, you must use the SSL configuration specified here. Below is a list of valid outbound connection protocols you can use with the following protocol strings. Click Add. Choose my new SSL configuration. Click Get Certificate Aliases. Note, make sure under the Certificate Alias menu, it specifies the certificate alias that is used as the identity for the connection. Click OK. Click Save. Important. You only need to restart the application server that uses the dynamic outbound SSL. You have successfully completed the setup. Thanks for watching this episode of IBM Support TV. Please leave a comment with topics you would like to see in future episodes. Until then, stay tuned.